Just here at Fun Motorsports, checking out some 2014 ski dudes that they have here. This one's a uh, free ride, 137. This one comes with those uh, KYB 40 shocks, fully adjustable. It's really nice units. This also has the full skid on it. Let's see how wide that is. Uh, we'll show you an example of. Uh, of the uh, extreme skid next to it here. You can see an extreme skid is just a little narrower. So personal preference as to what a guy wants. This one comes with the uh, R-Motion suspension on here as well. Nice looking sled. This one next to it. It's a new red and white Summit X. This one's a 146. Those uh, red and white colors are new for uh, 2014. I showed you the uh, extreme skid plate on here. It's a little narrower than the full skids that it comes with. They put a nice uh, custom wrap on here from SCS Unlimited. Nice little custom touch they put on the wraps. This also has the five piece screen kit. There's one, two, three, there's four, and the fifth one is actually behind the screen here on the side. Let's look inside. In the back here, they, they put the short bag on. This is that uh, the Q Link system. How it works. Pull that off, flip that little switch, everything lifts right off. Very simple to use. Slip back in there. Slides in like that. Pull the switch back, put the strap back on, you're good to go. Super quick. Also on this one, this one came with the MBRP can. Quite a difference from stock. There's big cans on there, so some guys like these, other guys like different ones. That's what they happen to put on this build here. Next to this one, this is a new flat black, it's the Summit X 146. Once again, this one comes with the full skid. Also has the gas can on the back. If you compare those two bags, the one on the left is a low bag, and the one on the right is a medium bag, both with the Q-Link system. Next to that, we have a stock Summit SP-154, you know, it's the orange-black combo, you know, nice looking slide as well. I just want to explain this T-Motion a little bit on here. Side of the track here, you can see how bendable it is, how pliable it is. The sides here, where if I go to an arm motion, like what's on this 137 free ride, it's very stiff. Those, those metal rods actually come to the end on these tracks. Pan over here. So the Renegade X Backcountry. This one's a 137, as well as that one. Both these sleds actually started out looking like this one. Um, this one as well. Some mods they put on here. They put the extreme skid on there. So the extreme skid is a little narrower than the full one. They also put on that five-piece screen kit. The front, two sides there, the center, and behind that uh, screen there is another one. 
This has the uh, extreme low windshield. Very nice. Also has the free ride handlebars on here. With the green free ride skis. So if people see this, they think, hey, that's a free ride. It's not. That's actually that uh, Renegade Extreme Backcountry. So. Some other options they put on this one. Comes with the uh, chassis stiffeners on both sides, powder coated white. Put on a white rear snow flap as well. Very nice looking unit. Once again, custom wrap by SCS. Next to that, it's a Renegade 600 E-Tech. This one's just a 137 inch track. Very nice looking unit. Once again, has a five piece screen kit. Um, kind of like how this has a different style of bumper on it as well. Once again, that wrap is from SCS. Also comes with the chassis stiffeners. This feature. Now on the back, the Q-Link, the medium bag and the gas can. Just looking units. All these sleds are all for sale. Ready for uh, their fun days here on Saturday. So you guys come on down and check some of these sleds out. Very nice units. Getting all geared up for winter here for sure. Cheers, you guys.